people need to understand that there are man-made and spiritual laws regarding money. And when I learned the spiritual laws, I started to attract money from all angles. But this didn't happen overnight. This is from trial and error, but also becoming a student of prosperity. I've always been fascinated with prosperity. Why is it that one person can be absolutely rich while another person just can't seem to get it together? What separates the two? What is the rich man or woman doing that the poor man or woman isn't? There has to be something. After years and years of internal dialogue and studying the mechanics behind prosperity, I figured it out. What separates the rich from the poor comes down to self-image. How do you see yourself? How do you speak to yourself? Because your self-image becomes your reality. How you view yourself internally on a subconscious level becomes your outer reality. See, poor people think money is hard to make. There is limited opportunities. There may not be enough. What if I fail? I always fail. And so on and so forth. But the rich man or woman says, what if I succeed? You know, there's millions of millionaires in the world. Why can't I be one of them? It all starts off with seeing yourself living that lifestyle, holding that image in your mind's eye of you living in absolute wealth and prosperity. See yourself. Now, you may not fully believe that it's possible, but the more you think those thoughts and the more you speak those affirmations of wealth, the more the subconscious begins to jump on board with you. See, we are constantly training and retraining and restructuring our subconscious beliefs. Everything is fluid. Nothing set in stone. We can change a belief and we can change our self-image, but it takes time and it takes effort. Because believe it or not, you and I have some bad programming. Since we were little kids, we've been watching Disney movies of the rich guy being the bad guy or the rich depriving the poor. So now subconsciously, many of us think, oh, rich is bad and poor is good. That's nonsense. Poverty is not a virtue. It's an illness. It's a sickness that needs to be eradicated. Poverty isn't natural. Lack is not natural. We were made to live in abundance. Prosperity and abundance is our true nature. This is why it feels bad when we are in lack. Because our true nature is abundance. Prosperity. But it starts with you. You must consciously decide consciously decide all right i'm going to be rich and then i am rich see first you say i'm going to be this and then switch that affirmation to i am this affirmations speak to the subconscious mind think of affirmations as commands you are commanding your subconscious mind so you always start your affirmations in the present tense. I am or I have. I am rich. I have more than enough. I am prosperous. I have more money than I know what to do with. See, these are some of my favorite affirmations because I say it all the time. They just roll off my tongue. Because I understand that 
My words are a form of creation. What you say is what you get. Your words are a form of command in the physical world. Listen to me. We're always creating laws for ourselves. That's how powerful you are. We're always creating laws for ourselves. So if you say, I can't do something or I don't have it, you just created a brand new law. And trust me, you're going to see it. You're going to see examples of that law all around you. So it would behoove you to create brand new laws of prosperity, brand new laws of wealth. I am abundant. I am taken care of. See, people think the universe gives you good things based on your good behavior, but that's not how the system works. The universe gives you more of what you give it. So if you're giving out energy, vibrations of doubt, negativity, lack, not having enough, the universe has to give you examples in the physical world of the energy that you're broadcasting. But if you're broadcasting wealth, abundance, more than enough, gratitude, watch out. Your reality will become unrecognizable. Gratitude will transform your life. If you have $3 in your bank account right now, I guarantee you, if you give gratitude, I mean sincere gratitude that you have that money, it will multiply. It will double. Somehow, some way, you'll find money. Somebody will give you money. You will receive checks in the mail. Something will happen, but you will double your money gratitude see these are some of the spiritual laws regarding money not all of them just some my wife and i we have a online course that is dedicated to prosperity to passive income to making money online but in that course we cover the man-made laws and the spiritual laws these are just some of the spiritual laws. If you're interested, my wife and I have decided to give a $200 discount to the first 100 people to sign up. The promo code is YAC97NOW. YAC97NOW is the promo code. If you're interested, you don't have to buy it, but if you're serious about Starting your own business, starting your own online business, passive income. I know for a fact you'll find this course extremely valuable. This is Justin from You Are Creators. I love you all. Thank you so much for your support, for your love. Trust me, I feel it. Thank you so much. And we support your dreams.